Assalamu alaikum my dear students, how are you? I hope you are all well by the grace of Almighty. Welcome to NIMS Home School. I am Ashish Bishash, an assistant teacher of mathematics in National Ideal English Version School Morning Shift. Today I am going to take a math class for the student of class 4. So my dear student, let us start our class. Dear student, today is our lecture number 1 of half yearly examination and today's HW number 1 also. My dear student, our today's topic name Today's topic name from your EMB book, page number 5. From page number 5, we have to solve 2 and 3 number question. From 2, we shall solve 4 and 5. And from 3, we shall solve 4 and 5 as your CW. Okay. As your CW. Okay. My dear student, it is not 4. It will be 3 and 4. It will be 3 and 4. From 2, we shall solve 3 and 4. And from 3, we shall solve 4 and 5 as your CW. And my dear student, from 2, 1, 2. And from 3, 1, 2 will be your HW. You must do your HW in your HW copy and submit it regularly in our school campus in every Saturday within 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. So my dear student, let us start our class. Here you notice 4 mathematics lecture number 1 and HW number 1. So my dear student, please open your math book page number 5 of your elementary mathematics book. So my dear student, two number question. At first you read the question. Read aloud. That means at first <coughs> we need read to we need to read the number. Okay. And write in words. Here the number is given in number. We need to write the, uh, the word in number. Then show their place value like above. That means we need to uh, write the place value of this number. So at first we solve question number 3 of 2. So 2, 3. In order to solve this math at first we need to write given that given that the number is 5, 6, 0, 9, 3, 2, 0. So, at first we need to learn the use of comma in a number. How can? My dear student, from right hand side we count. At first we take three digit. One, two, three digit and give one comma. Then each time we take two digit and give comma. One, two, so here comma. And one, two, no need to write here any comma because there is no digit, uh, no digit before this two digit. Okay. So, I hope you have understood how to put comma. I repeat. At first, we take three digit from right hand side. One, two, three. Then we put a comma. Again, we consider two digit. One, two. Then we put a comma. In each case, we take two digit to put comma. I hope you have understood. Now, my dear student, we read aloud. Notice ones place, tens place, hundred place, thousand place, ozud place, lak place, and nizud place. My dear student, these two place consist 100,000 uh, place and these two place consist lakh place. So, we read this number as 56 lakh 9,320. So, first portion is done. Read aloud. That means we need to read this number. I repeat 56 lakh 9,320. I hope you have understood. Now, we write this number in word. So, how can in what the number is we just write 56 56 lakh a f i f t y 56 lakh 9000 9000 9300 100 20 320 I hope you have understood 56 lakh 9320 okay so in order to write this you have to learn the spelling of thousand hundred fifty six lakh nine twenty I hope you have understood now we find out the place value of this number so we have already learned in class 3 how to find out place value, right? So, write this number first. 
56 lakhs 9320 first of all we write here ones tens place hundred place thousand place ozud place lakh place and nizud place so we write this as zero ones okay then two tens okay then three hundreds three hundreds then nine thousand okay then zero ojuts then six lakhs then five nijut okay so these two digit these two places consist thousand place and these two places consist last uh, lakh place so here we give equal sign in each section okay now we my dear student we just write this way zero once that means here we write zero then two tens that means 20 so here we write zero and two is written here okay then 300 that means here zero here zero and here three nine thousand that means zero 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 nine then zero ojuts that means zero 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 okay if you don't want to write this five zero then you can easily write one zero both are correct okay so zero 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 for your better understand i write this the six lakhs that means zero 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 and six lakhs then five nijuts that means five zero 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 and five i hope you have understood this one next we shall solve question number four just similar way i hope you have understood how to write this so first of all given that given that the number is what the number is one 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 okay then we use comma that means at first we count three digits from right hand side one two three one two so we read this number aloud first eleven lakh eleven thousand one hundred and eleven so we write this number in word now what is the spelling of eleven e l e v e n 11 lakh then 11000 11000 100 111 e l e v e n okay i hope you have understood now we need to find out the place value last just like this this one so here right one 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 so one ones one ones then one ten then one hundreds then one thousand then one ojut then one lakhs then one nijut my dear student, you don't erase and write. You must do separate math, right? Okay. So one ones means one. Then one tens means ten. Then one hundred means one hundred. Then one thousand means one thousand. Then one ozut means ten thousand. Then one lakh means one lakh. Then on nizut means 
टेन लाख ओके दिस इज द आंसर ऑफ क्वेश्चन फोर माई डे स्टूडेंट प्लीज नोटिस योर एज डब्लू टू नंबर क्वेश्चन नंबर वन एंड टू यू शैल सॉल्व दिस मैथ जस्ट लाइक दिस वन एट फर्स्ट यू यूज कॉमा हेयर आफ्टर दैट यू रीड द नंबर एंड फाइनली वी कन्वर्ट इट इन टू वर्ड्स एंड फाइंड आउट द प्लेस वैल्यू जस्ट लाइक दिस वे ओके वन एंड टू आर इन सिमिलियर मैथड ओके नेक्स्ट वी शैल सॉल्व क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री राइट इन फिगर दैट मीन्स सो इज इन मैथ we just write this number in number here the number is given in odds we convert this into number only so first of all please notice number 3 1 so here the number the number made of 7 lakhs 3 10000 here Seven lakh and three ten thousands equal to seven lakh means seven and three ten three ten thousand means thirty thousand three ten thousand means thirty thousand so and. I hope you have understood. Ones, tens, hundred, thousand, ojut, and lakh. So seven lakh thirty thousand is the answer of this question. Next number. This is four number, and this is five number. Is the number made of four ten lakhs, four ten lakhs, eight thousand and three hundreds. Here. Four ten lakh eight thousand three hundred three hundred. Notice four ten lakhs means forty eight thousand. That means ozut place is absent. So ozut place will be zero and eight thousand and three hundred. That means here we write three hundred. Tens place and ones place is absent. So here we write zero zero. Now we put comma one two three one two. Right. So this is the answer and this is another answer. So just like this way you have to do your S W question number one and two of three. Okay. My dear student, you must do your S I N S W in your S W copy and submit it regularly in our school campus in every Saturday within nine a.m. to 3 pm my dear student i hope you have understood my today's lecture keep practicing at home abide by your parents see you soon till then assalamu alaikum